In today's project, I'm going to be working with my buddy Adrian. Uh, we're going to be working on a 1995 BMW 750iL. We're going to be changing the uh, rear sunshades. In today's project, you will need a, a flathead screwdriver, a Phillips head screwdriver, and a uh, smaller flathead screwdriver, preferably a long one. So, first steps to uh, taking off the uh, the sunshade uh, would be uh, taking off the um, smaller sunshade, which is located right here, uh, in order for us to release the uh, the panel of the of the door. In order to release the uh, the smaller sunshade, there is a, a small a pinhole that uh, releases the clip that holds it in place. So with a smaller screwdriver, uh, you would have to uh, kind of fish it out and um, locate the pin, slightly bring it up, and you'd see it clip out just like that, and uh, you slowly uh, bring it out from the bottom. So now that we have the, uh, the smaller sunshade out, I just wanted to uh, zoom in on the little pinhole that I was talking about. So with a small screwdriver, you would essentially go in like that and pretty much just bring up the clip like like that and just release it so that a clip will go off of it and uh, you would have the uh, the sunshade out. Next step is to take out the, uh, the panel. So we have uh, clips going alongside right here at the bottom of the panel. Uh, we have a, a screw right behind the uh, door handle. Uh, we have the window switch and the, uh, the light at the bottom. Um, Adrian, is there a uh, is there a tip you can give us that you, how, what's the easiest way to uh, take out the panel? Either panel pliers or a flathead screwdriver and you kind of feel well where the clips are attached. So just pry them lightly and with the screwdriver pull away. So pull towards the car, not towards the panel because you're going to rip right through it if you do towards the panel. Okay, alright. So uh, let's get uh, right to it then. Okay. So we're going to start by uh, taking out the, uh, the pin that's located right behind the, uh, the door handle. So it looks something along, along these lines right here. Next step is just to uh, take out the, uh, the window switch. Just kind of Careful. pry it carefully, eh? You don't damage the leather. Mm -hmm. and, and you find that the smaller screwdriver, the smaller flathead screwdriver works best? Yeah, and pull away from the leather. Pull away from the leather, okay. Okay, there you have it. And did you uh, press any clips to take that out? Is there yeah, a... just squeeze it at the ends. Oh, so those both ends have a clip? Okay. Depending, depending on what year car you have, the socket is different. Okay, but and in this one, it's just this one, both just sides. clip it. They're all okay. going to be squeeze them out, but it just looks different. Okay. okay. So what's the, what's the next step? Taking out the bolt out of here. Yes. And if you have a later model, it's going to be a torque set. Okay. Okay. And then again, the light at the bottom. Okay. Doing all the hard parts and even be at the best <laughs> for last, eh? Alright. Okay, so now that we have that out, again with the, with the clip, we took it out. So it was in there holding by four, I guess, clips, you could say, in place. So after you, you take it out, you just pretty much, again, it was, was it squeeze, uh, you squeeze yeah. it out? just pull it right oh, out. Pull it right out, okay, okay. That's it, so the light is out now, and the next step is the uh, the panel. Yeah. Okay, so again, with the, we're using a flathead screwdriver, okay? Yep, mm -hmm. flathead screwdriver, just popping all of them out like that. And you see. Okay, there you go. Slowly giving in. All around. Okay. Is it out now? Yeah, so now we just need to, it's got some slides right out over the top. So we just need to lift it up. Lift it up, okay. There we go. Right. That's it. 
Now the door handle won't release, so oh, that... Oh, let's take Okay, so I'll hold it, and then you can... Uh, no, but it's you just need to... No, no, no. The door handle is going to stay on the door. Oh, it is? Yeah. So you just need to do it kind of like this. Take note. And then that's it. That's your door panel on. Slow to kick out all the wiring. Yep. Just clip and release, eh? Everything is clipped in. And that's it. Doors up. Yeah. All right. So a quick tip: um, when uh, you have the panel out, uh, it's uh, it's actually um, a good uh, good um, idea to take out the um, the chrome piece that's uh, I guess uh, covering the um, the leather uh, the leather piece from the um, the panel, uh, and I guess it's uh, it's right underneath the uh, the smaller sunshade. Uh, so when you take this out, you can actually put this back on the panel, and so when you're putting the panel back on, it's actually much easier that way, right? Um, so Adrian, what's uh, what's what's next after, uh, next after this? Next, Philip said here, 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 and here. These fours gotta be removed first. Okay. This is what holds the bottom sun, the uh, small sun chain. Okay. This is what it looks like for the um, the piece that the bottom piece of the uh, the smaller sun chain. You have to remember which way you take these off because they only go one specific way. Okay, okay. We have all four of the uh, yeah. pins out. So now two more Phillips head in the end and uh, there's your door shape. All right, there you have it. The uh, the larger sunshade from the, uh, for the rear of the 7 Series. Now that we have the uh, the old sunshade out, we're going to be replacing it with the with the brand new one. Okay, Adrian. So what's uh, what's the first step? So again, we, we're just going to put well, right in and yeah. uh, uh, screw it right back on, right? One trick: have a buddy, <laughs> <laughs> hang it from the top. Okay. And then you'll just hold it down at the bottom. Oh, perfect. And it's right in place. There you go. Nice. Just like that. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'll hold it right in place. Bit. Okay. That's it. All right. Very nice. So now we just gotta put back all the stuff we took out uh, <laughs> with, uh, with the panel yeah, and the uh, smaller uh, sun uh, sunshade. Yeah. Now that it's also hanging, you can just adjust it a little bit so it's not too tight. You're not stressing the springs. Okay. And you're good. Leave it hanging so you can put these up and then you can lower it. After putting all the three. Uh, the clips in. Uh, we have the uh, the clip that holds in the uh, the smaller sunshade. So this is a good time to put that back in. There. Yeah. This we'll just put it on just like that. Don't tighten it because you'll need to adjust it later. Okay. After you put in the sunshade. After you oh. after you put the door panel on, you'll want to adjust that where it goes right into place because you don't want it at an angle and then it doesn't clip. Okay. Oh, perfect. So we are ready for the the door panel now. Yeah. Right. Okay. okay. Is there a tip on how to, uh, where to start? Feed all the wires first. Okay. You have to feed them through the door, connect everything, make sure you're not forgetting anything, and that's it. Door and the post first, and then we have the, uh, the, the lock. Yep. So after uh, you pretty much uh, put it in, uh, clip it all in, just make sure to check and see if all the clips are back in, uh, nothing is loose, and uh, it's nice and sturdy before putting in um, all, the, um, all the screws and the clipping back, uh, back in the light and the, uh, the window switch. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Would, would this be the right time to put the, uh, the chrome piece here? Or? Yeah, we'll tighten this one first, and then we'll put the chrome piece in. Okay, right on. Okay. 
Alright. I want one. So not the uh, the small uh, sunshade? Yeah. So you put in the uh, the bottom first, slide it in the hole in the socket in the bottom first. And clips right in. And you you're can done. hear it. You can hear the clip. Okay. Alright, so we assembled everything back together now. So we have a uh, bigger sunshade that, uh, that works. And we also have a uh, smaller sunshade that also works. And uh, there you have it. Finished product. Like and subscribe for more videos. And uh, add comments below with questions or suggestions. Cheers.